Tom. I'm 60. I'm retired. I think I should be 100% in stocks because bond yields suck. What do you think? I agree that bond yields, well, let's just say that they're unusually low right now with 10-year U.S. Treasury bonds recently yielding roughly 2%. But that doesn't mean you should go to an all-stock portfolio. Why? Well, for one thing, you're retired, and presumably you'll need whatever money you have in 401ks, IRAs, and other retirement accounts to help support you the rest of your life. If a high-quality bond is paying 2%, 3%, or whatever, you can be reasonably sure you'll get those payments. The stock market can be a white-knuckle roller coaster ride with huge swings in value. And even though history shows that the long-term gain potential for stocks is much higher than that for bonds, those lofty returns are hardly guaranteed and there can be long periods where stocks lag. Granted, bonds can lose money too if interest rates go up, as they almost inevitably will at some point. But bond prices have never come close to the 50% or more nosedives that stock prices have. So I think what you really want is a balanced approach. You want some of your savings in bonds for security and regular income, even if it's meager right now, and some in stocks for long-term growth potential so you can maintain your purchasing power in the face of inflation.